Hi everybody, Broomstitch Rita here. Happy Monday to you. Thank you for being here. And I am very excited to share some Easter items with you guys. I've been I have been working really hard at these items and uh, I'm really excited to share them with you. What I have here are two sets of my little scrappy mini journals that you have seen on my uh, e in my eBay shop before but not the Easter theme ones Easter theme ones these are Easter theme I have two sets each contain five little blank mini journals that are nice little tuck-in gifts is what they are you know just put them in your purse tuck them in a gift whatever you want to do with them so I have two sets and this is the first set. I'm just going to show you the covers. The inside are blank, uh, coffee dyed and non coffee dyed papers, crunchy, and um, they are about 20 pages front to back, each of them. So I just, that's one of my favorite bunnies. I don't know if the camera picks it up, but I just absolutely love that bunny. I might have to do something in a bigger size with that bunny on something else because I absolutely love it. Oh, it's so cute. Anyways, that's little lace on there. And then this one has a big, big Easter egg and sorry silk and a little Peter Rabbit stamp here. And then this is so cute, little pastel colors. And this is on a cupcake, a uh, Easter cupcake that I sewed it on. And then this big one, so cute, the grungy looking with this beautiful uh, trim that I have coffee dyed heavily. And then it also includes one of the five little notepads. And here is, or the journals, is an original ledger paper that I have. Um, 1920 right here it says the writing is incredible the fountain pen that they use I just absolutely love it and the patina on this paper is just unmatched unsurpassed so it's I really wanted to share it so I've created little journals out of it so that's one set little Easter one listed already in my eBay shop and the other one is a Peter Rabbit Peter Rabbit so cute look at that bunny Oh my gosh, so adorable. I love bunnies. And then this one, this trim. Every one is different. And then uh, this one, this ribbon has carrots on there, just so cute. And this one says Happy Easter, right here in the middle. Happy Easter. And then, of course, I have the ledger one is one of them. So I have these two sets, the Peter Rabbit and then the Easter. So that's how they are listed. Uh, five little cute um, junk journals. And I have these two only right now that are listed, but I will be making more. I will most likely not take a video of the new ones that I'll make um, in the coming weeks. I will just post them in my eBay shop so you can just uh, check my eBay shop or you know just click on the heart that says save this seller and then you get an automatic notification of uh, when I whenever I post a new item in my shop so yeah these two should be listed and then I have completed my first well this year's first Easter journal I have completed it today and I want to share this with you uh, this should be listed by the time this video is up. But before I share this with you, just a quick flip through of it. I wanted to share something else that I'm making for Easter. It is these little sets. I apologize. I had to go grab them. These are going to be little sets. I'm not exactly sure what all I'm including in them yet. But I know there will be uh, multiple items in them, like scrappy notepads, little gift tags. So cute. This is a Peter Rabbit, Peter Rabbit themes. Bookmarks, Peter Rabbit bookmarks. 
There will be gift bags in them that you can use for gift giving. I have different gift bags. Um, and this fat bunny that I made and, and uh, did the eyes on. Uh, so there, these will, be, these will be little sets. Oh, and where is that? Oh yeah, this really soft yarn, just baby soft yarn, light, very light pink. And then I have some eyelash trim also that's in white. So I will be including that too. And the, uh, again, sorry about that. I didn't have everything ready here. I will also have all these will be encased or enclosed in a fabric pouch or bag, a uh, grungy fabric bag that I am, I haven't started actually working on those yet, but they'll have something like this on the front. These uh, collages I have made this past weekend. Um, this is so cute. I just love it, love it, love it. This is on, uh, I made it on uh, burlap. So I made a bunch of these collages that I will use on the uh, fabric bag that this set will come in. So this will be called something like Easter set. I don't know, junk journal set. It will also have a little junk journal with it. So I will be working on these. There will be several of these sets. Again, I'm not sure if I do a video of this set when I'm done, but you just, just check my uh, eBay shop. So now, let me just share, oh, I just dropped them, that's okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, I wanna share this um, big journal with you that I made. I just love this bunny on here. Did I already say I love bunnies? Yes, I did, I believe. I love bunnies. Coffee dyed, it's a pretty grungy cover, as you can see. I think that the camera is picking that up. It's on a vintage file folder. Nicely stuffed, fully embellished, not gonna go through the entire journal, not gonna take things out of the pocket. That's for you to discover. This one is a big pocket right here when you open it up and it has a pretty grungy collage on here that I created. And goodies in there, flip out, lots of Easter yummy goodness in here. Just cute this one lifts up I have messages uh, stamped in here in multiple places in the journal and that's what this is just one of the things that I do here's a little collage lift up pocket with goodies and then inside here is another pocket with goodies this lifts up and this is a really uh, rusted up um, safety pin that I put a little ribbon on and then this kind of sticks out so I put another ribbon on it look at this bunny down here oh my gosh that adorable just so adorable <gasps> man just love it this is one of the bunnies that I made the fat bunnies I made it into a collage on a little paper doily lots of ruffles lots of lace coffee dyed crunchy 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 papers this one lifts out for writing I try to leave writing room and create more writing room by putting in these flips and flops, just like these two. I love this little vintage chick, Easter chick, so cute. Love it, love it, love it. Like I said, this journal should be listed by the time you see this video. More goodies in here. This is a vintage handkerchief that I made into a ruffle. And a collaging. This I intentionally left blank for you on both sides so you can write on it. Another little collage with a fat bunny. This is also from a vintage handkerchief. Another pocket with goodies. Another lift out for you to write on. And cute little, cute little bunnies here. Even the smallest one can change the world. And here is one of my double bows on top with some seam binding. So that's the journal, a quick, very cl a quick flip through. Uh, there's a lot to discover in here and a lot of goodies in there. So that's what I wanted to share. I try to keep my videos around 10 minutes so I don't uh, take up too much of your time. So this is listed the big, 
journal and then these two little journal sets the bunny the peter rabbit and then the easter one so like i said i will be creating more of these little journal sets but they are nice little gifts so this is the first of this year's big easter journal that's done and i'm working on this one i'm working on two more this one i'm working on it and this quilt covered one quilt covered one i'm working on that too so yeah those will be done i don't think it, they're gonna be done this week but um i don't know i don't know when next uh, coming week coming weeks so watch for um the sets that i mentioned that will come in the fabric bag and then more journals lots of lots of easter goodies i just love bunnies so i want to share the cuteness of them with you guys in lots of different shapes and forms so just uh, keep in touch and you guys have a great week and peace out.